Hello friends. In today's class, we are going to see syntax directed definition for directed acyclic graph that is DAG. Welcome again and uh, here we are discussing this uh, the SDD for the DAG syntax directed definition for the DAG and here uh, I have taken the example over here that this is A. So now I want to generate the DAG for this sentence and how the DAG will be generated for it. So here P1 is the is is there are only two functions are there that is there is a leaf and there is a node. Okay, so the, this is the this is the only two function and we'll be able to generate the uh, DAG for it. Okay, so now P1 is the leaf and here P1 will be current, uh, creating here a node that is a leaf node that is A. Uh, then we have uh, another uh, uh, P2 but P1 is equal to P2 will be also pointing to the same leaf node. So let me just point the entry over here. Then there is a P3 and P3 will create a leaf of uh, B. So there is a P3 and then there is a B. And then P4 uh, there is another leaf and P4 will be able to generate this C. Okay, so A, B, C has been created. Now we will create a node with the minus uh, and P3 and P4. So as you can see that B minus C will be evaluated first. So there will be a, a node with the sign minus and there will be a, a that it will refer to the P3 and P4 to so this pointer will refer to the P3 and this pointer will refer to the P4. Then we'll create a star okay and a star and there will be another no, a node that will be star and this star will have a pointer towards the P1 and P5 okay so uh, this minus is we are denoting as here as P5. So now this uh, star will have a P1 and P5. So this node will be P1 uh, pointing to this star and P1 and P5. So this is your P1 and this one is your P5. Then we have another node which is having P1 and uh, with the plus. Okay, we have another node with plus and two pointer values are there in this. There are the two pointer values. And in that two pointer value, uh, we have a uh, uh, P1 and P6. So this new node which is star is assigned to P6. So this is P6. There is a P1 that will point to node P1. So let me just join this one and this one P6. Uh, there is another multiplication over here and that multiplication is for P1 and P5. The P1 and P5 we have done and plus we have done and minus we have done. So we have done up to here. Fine. The next is a leaf of uh, B, which is a leaf of B is there. Leaf of B is already there and that will denote as still as P8 already there. And P9, there is already leaf that is, uh, that we'll see uh, P4. P9 is also the same. And then again, there is a node of with minus. Okay, then there is a minus P3 and P4. Uh, P3 and P3 and P4 and that we call it as P5 and that is also termed as P10. So that is another term here is pointer number 10. This node I'm talking about. Then we have a leaf entry of ID. So P11 is a, another leaf entry P11. Let's call it as P11 and that is for D. This one and then there is a star a star multiplication and the two pointer for this multiplication is uh, P5 so this we have already seen P5 so this is one node that it is pointing to and then P11 that is the new node multiplied here. Finally there is a uh, and we call this one as node as P12. P12. Oh sorry this was P7. Okay now finally we have a node that is plus okay that is plus and it will point to P7 so this is P7 and P 12 okay so this is how the DAG will be created DAG will be created for the expression
okay and now this same uh, concept of leaves and all uh, the same pointer value if it is already evaluated that we are taking care of uh, the same thing can be done with the uh, can be written as a rule okay, a translation rule okay, and that will is nothing but s t d syntax directed definition so thank you